if you guys don't know what this game is, this is called This War of Mine. Uh, actually, I think one of the devs sent me a code for the game. Or maybe it was just a viewer or something. I'm not really sure. The, the email was a little odd. Um, but I got a Steam code. And I was like, oh, I guess I'll check it out. And I, I have someone, uh, and then another viewer tweeted at me and said uh, that it was it was worth the uh, the look at. So I, I played it for a little bit. That's why there's a continue. But we're just gonna do another try. We're gonna start from scratch. Um, basically, what this game is? No, it's not. A, it's not really a horror game. It is. Oh shit! Day one, it is getting very cold. Oh shit! I've never played a winter one. Oh, this isn't good. <laughs> Oh God, of course. So basically what your goal is, um, is to survive. It's like a platformer style game, um, but it's all about stealth and gathering resources and pretty much just trying to survive for as long as possible. There are guns. There is a little bit of combat in this game because uh, you do run into other scavengers in the military and stuff like that. Many people living in the capital did not believe that war would come to them, but it did. The military cut off the city from the outside world. Hunger and disease are widespread. There is no running. <clears throat> excuse me. There is no running water. Sniper bullets and mortar shells are a constant threat. Marin lost everything in a fire that destroyed his workshop. Erica fled to the capital, following the massacre of her town, only to find the capital besieged. And Kataya, I think that's how you pronounce Kataya. Uh, who came to report from the war zone has befriended them in the queue at the water pump With nowhere to stay they decide to make a ruined building their temporary home and then it, it drops us into the game So that is where we are. So I actually have two female characters this time, which is the very first time I've ever had that so Erica sneaks quietly Marin is a handyman and Katia Katia, I don't know cat. I'm gonna call her cat and cat has bargaining skills so each character kind of has their own little, I don't know, their own little, uh, I guess, skill. Uh, I had one earlier that was like, he was like combat. He was just a badass. Can't remember his name though. Uh, so, okay. So it drops us in here. You have three players. You get a timer. I probably should get shit going. We only have one chair. We lack beds. Okay. So first things first, food, beds, um, workshop. So what I'm going to do is we're going to, Trying to think the best way to start it. Okay, we don't have actually first thing first. We need to we need to get some resources. What is this? Oh, it's winter, so it starts us off with a heater. Interesting. I've never seen that. Okay, we gotta start looting everything. So we gotta get resources quickly. Is what we need to do. Uh so grab all. So it starts you off with a decent amount of stuff. You just gotta, so right here, there's like piles. So you can, you can get upgrades. Um, you can get, you can, so you can upgrade even like the workbenches and the different little stations. Now, the only problem is I need a shovel so I can get through this pile quicker. But uh, we'll just keep looting all this stuff. It's hard to keep track of three guys at once actually. So this guy, she'll be there for a while. Grab all these sort resources. Grab all these resources. And then you need to go down here. And you need to go, uh, I guess, I guess up here. Start digging up this. Grab all. And <clears throat> voice crack is real. What is this? Oh shit, there's snow. I can shovel snow. Oh, th well that's pretty nice actually. I should be able to melt that down and get water. Yeah, it's a late stream, but I wanted to play this. I don't know, it's it's kind of interesting. It's kind of fun, so. So I guess first things first is we need fuel for the fire or we're gonna fucking freeze to death. It's negative one Celsius. What is that in Fahrenheit? I don't know Celsius. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit. Well, freezing is, what, 32 degrees Fahrenheit? So, it's like 30 degrees. Something like that. Uh, okay. Dig, dig through that. What are you doing, lady? Oh, I didn't even loot that. Oops. Open this. This dude's just chilling. I gotta, okay, get through this door.
What do you do in this game? You you uh, survive, man. It's all about. So you guys will see. I can end the day and then I go on night raids, kind of thing where one person has to go and. Okay, okay, Jesus, open this and loot it, you son of a bitch. Okay, don't actually go in the chair. Uh, you need to start digging through. Go open this. And then you start digging through here. Oh shit, this is like halfway done. I must have moved around accident. I am not in danger, Skylar. I am the danger. Gypsy King, thanks for subbing. Thanks, man. Welcome, dude. Uh oh, I didn't start my I didn't start my sub thing. That's why I didn't come up. I'm sorry, Gypsy Gypsy King. I'm an asshole. But I did see it. Thank you so much for subbing, buddy. Boyd, how you doing, buddy? Thanks for the donation, my man. So they're all oh, okay, she's done finally. Open this shit. Oh, when I see some, give me something good. Give me something really good. I'll take all that. We'll have to sort through all this shit later. But the the day is almost over, so I I did not do this quickly at all. I was really slow with. I was kind of distracted. So, the problem is I should have gotten all the resources done when the timer. By the time the timer was done. But I've been distracted by reading the chat and stuff. So what we need, we need, what do we need? What's really important? Cook food, rainwater collector. We need a bed. We need at least one bed. So let's make a bed. Uh, let's have our bed like here by the heater. Maybe that'll work out. What we do need, so she's going to go build this bed. She needs to open this. Come on, Erica. Pixel! Pixel, thanks for subbing. I appreciate it. Uh, grab all. The timer's about to run down, though. Shit. Well, let's see. They're all, they're all fine right now, so no panic. I guess day one is pretty much a tutorial anyway. No face cam tonight. I'm just chilling. Or not right now. I mean, it's a late stream. And I don't want to turn my lights on, so... Uh, let's see. Uh, who's a good scavenger? Got 12 slots. We'll just... Yeah, we'll do this. Scavenge. I am sleep, not in danger, guard. Skyler. I am the danger. The man. Marin gets to... Ruined block of flats. Lots of food. Huge amounts of materials. We'll just start there. Actually, I think that's the only... Yeah, yeah let's just start there. Prepare. Do we have a knife or anything? Did I get lucky? No. All right. Let's scavenge. I already have a heater. The heater, I guess, is just straight up there if you start on a snow one. I've never played in the snow. It's so empty and quiet here, it gives me the creeps. Loot that shit. Grab all. Hey guys, T. Martin here. Today I'm going to show Russell Wilson how to play football and just you know how to survive and not die against the arrowheads. Love you, Goldie. It was tight game. God damn you, Port Taco. God damn you. Don't remind me, man. I woke up and I missed the game because uh, I was very drunk last night. So I got, I was hung over and I just, I slept in. The baby carriage isn't empty. A few objects lie scattered inside a rattle, a smiling red crab, well worn by baby teeth. The crab? What? A feeding bottle half full of... Ooh. Someone must have left them in a terrible rush or maybe didn't need them anymore. Oh shit, I didn't even do it again. Well, we should have taken the baby formula. I would have drank that. We're in dire need of everything. Coffee. Okay, we need coffee. Cigarettes. Parts. Take this. Oh, ammo. I don't... Weapon parts will be good to start... I don't think we need ammunition yet. And we can come back here if we ever need some. Uh, what's through this door? Uh, is it, wait, is this like a, you know, we might as well loot it. We might, we might be able to stack some stuff, even though our backpack's already full. And that's what I thought. God, there's so much. 
There's so much that I don't want to leave behind. Well, we can come back for it. This is a good, this is a good spot. We're gonna have to clear this whole spot out eventually. Just stack all these. Oh yeah. We don't need books. All right, let's just head back. We'll come back to this spot uh, the next tomorrow, the next night. That way we can get um, we can get all that loot. Unfortunately, though, you have to be really careful with what you get because you get hungry so it's so hard. Because if you're not hungry, if your characters aren't hungry, they're bored. If they're not bored, they're wounded. If they're not wounded, they're cold. They're you know they always have something fucking wrong with them. So. It's hard to, to, you have to balance everything out and make sure you're doing effing snow achievement unlocked. There's just a lot to take in, especially because eventually we'll get another character. So, okay, so what we need to do, first things first, um, hungry, tired, slept poorly, hungry, sick, hungry and tired. Okay, so everybody needs to eat. You, uh, eat some of this, you, let's build. Uh, let's build one more bed just to be sure uh, We need we need oh she didn't even finish building the bed god damn it dumbass Eat the goddamn food he's sick he's already sick these sons of bitches Man Now I've never actually gotten four guys because um, I always, one of my characters always dies towards the beginning. We need fuel is what we need. How do we create fuel again? Shit. It's going to get super cold. These guys are going to freeze. Okay. Actually, dude, no, no. You go up here. Go to the workbench. Oh, wait. What the hell is he doing? Oh. Sweet. How many do we put in here? Just put it all in here. It's already full of fuel. Okay. So how do we upgrade it? It heats up the shelter much more efficiently using less fuel. But I need a thermoregulator to do that. Which I have to upgrade the bench to do that. Yeah, what up, Golden Toxic? Late night stream hype. It's rather chilly inside. You think, motherfucker? We do need a metal workshop. Let's build that next. Might as well have it right next to it. Okay. Uh, what are you doing? Are you are still hungry? Okay. Then eat one more thing of food. And then what is she doing? She's hungry and tired. We'll go get some goddamn food. There's fucking food there for a reason, dumbass. Okay. This dude needs to crash because he's gonna get sick. And she's tired, so she needs to... Damn, everyone's tired. They're all fucking tired. The one guy I had sleep is is sick, so he has to sleep. So one of these guys is going to get sleep deprived. I guess we'll make it uh, her, because she can carry more. So this, she's going to go sleep in this bed. And she is going to go see if she can build some... Sh Actually, she should continue looting this area. I should loot everything first. Let's see. Oh, I didn't I didn't build that. He gave up halfway through. The struggle. She built a hot tub. Yeah, man. So this is Sims in a war zone. Yeah, kind of. It kind of has that feel. You'll see it. I haven't got past like day 20 and it takes a really long time. Like it's kind of slow, um, but it's fun. It's it's kind of a cool game. I, I really like it. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna make a shovel, and then we're gonna go through all this rubble. That way we can get to these other spots. It's actually nice because eventually you get to the point where all your guys are. You kind of have a cycle. So one one time you'll send out a scavenger, and then while two sleeping, one's guarding, hopefully. And you you just kind of have a cycle. That way everyone gets enough rest. Okay. So now. Uh, let's go through here. And then start moving all this rubble. 
Pictures blank? Yeah, I know. Dude, the first time I saw that, it was creepy. Now, you'll see, eventually, um, we'll be able to... There's, there is combat. We'll be able to um, find some of the military guys. And we might even be able to, like, shiv them. You can get, like, almost almost uh, instant kills if you come up behind them with knives. Unfortunately, we don't even have any knives right now, but... Okay, so what we need to do... Let's move up to... Shit, I don't think I can get... Uh, we can go through here. And if you double tap things, usually... I mean, you'll see her sprint up. Now she's sprinting. Can I do YouTube videos of me playing this? Yeah, man, this will go on... This will go on my Let's Play channel. That's where this will go. Uh, I like it, man. I like I said, I put in I put in about um, four hours of this game already off stream. So just because I didn't want to go into it completely blind and have no fucking idea what I was doing, but now I, I really like it. It's kind of a kind of a relaxing game. Oh shit! I should sleep off the last night. Well, you can't, Erica. So you just keep fucking digging, girl. You got like thirty more seconds until. Night hits, and then we gotta do. We gotta do shit. God damn it. I'm not gonna have enough time to get through here. Go, hurry. Loot it. Hurry, Erica. Erica, loot it. Oh no. GG, no re. I got like five seconds. Damn it. <laughs> All right. Uh, we're gonna send. Oh, she's not even tired. So actually, this is perfect. We're gonna send her out to scavenge sick on meds yeah well stop being a bitch you know what it's only night two we're gonna hope that we don't get raided i'm not gonna put anybody on guard uh military outpost sounds really dangerous and i don't want to die we're, we're just gonna go back to the ruined the ruined block of flats because i don't even have a knife yet and if i get a knife i can probably go to one of the dangerous ones but let's take the shovel and yeah, we'll just take the shovel. I highly doubt I'll need a lockpick. They're both going to die. No, they won't. They'll be all right. We do need to get knives and stuff so they can protect uh, the base better. We gotta board up. We gotta board up our building. I, I already did that. All right. Let me see what I left behind. Oh yeah, that's right. The bullets. Open this. Hopefully there's nobody here. Sometimes you come back and people are here raiding it. And they have... Most of them have fucking giant guns that will fuck you. So that's never good. You don't want to get fucked by giant guns. I got some books. That'll be good. That'll keep them happy. Even though it's only two books. Two books? Zaretto! Thanks for subbing, man. Welcome, dude. I appreciate it. Uh Oh shit. Oh, we can take one more of these. I still don't think the ammo is necessary right now. We need materials to build shit. So Let's see. I'm going to see if there's any like food or maybe some um maybe some bandages cuz someone's a bound someone is bound to get hurt. There's vegetables right there. Yeah, food's important. We'll get rid of the wood. Because we still got some scavenging to do in the... Oh, I'm not going to be able to get through that without a saw blade. I bet there's some good shit in there. Damn it. Yeah, and and this one. Uh, I wonder if I can go down here and jump around. Oh, the fire. I highly doubt it. I'm going to try, though. I'm not sure how to get there. Shit. Well, you're useless. All right. Run to the exit. We're good. Also, if you want to check out my Facebook or my Twitter, sound below, I'm going to dance!